Yo, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be showing you on how to make these two glitch try hard outfits and if you're new here, hit that subscribe button. What are you doing? Can you good luck tomorrow and the rest of the week? Join the family, let's not waste any more time and let's get straight into the video. Okay guys, before this video starts, I recommend watching the entire video because at the end of the video I have a special announcement. So stay tuned and watch the rest of the video. So the first step is go to the front counter at any clothing store on the map, go to outfits and go to where you find deadline and you will need to purchase the deadline purple outfit. Make your way over to the mask store. Once you're at the mask store, go to crime and purchase the black t-shirt mask and save this as an outfit. Once you've done that, purchase the combat helmet and aqua camo quad lens. After you do purchase the qualins, head over the, to the telescope so you can do the telescope glitch. Run past the telescope, push right on the d-pad and your mask should disappear once you got the telescope working right. Open up your interaction menu, go to style and go to the helmets and put on the qualins we purchased. Back out from the telescope and your interaction menu and walk away and your mask should be underneath your helmet like this. Once it is like that, make your way back to the mask store and save this as an outfit. At least one time so after you did save this as an outfit basically you will need an arcade business if you do not own one tell a friend to go to his arcade business to start up this job if you do have it basically you're going to start up the job called hacking device so after you start it up you should load in with a tuxedo if you do not load in with the tuxedo basically put find new session and start up the job again till you find it if you do have the tuxedo, basically you're just going to start up the mission and wait for Lester to set up the waypoint to do the mission. You see where the yellow waypoint is? Do not go over there. Basically, go to the any ammunition on the map, go to outfits, go to outfit saved and click on the outfit we were making. Select it, back out, and make your way to the destination where the yellow waypoint is now. Basically, you're just going to kill off all the FIB agents. And this part's really easy, just use the AR or LMG, I prefer the LMG. So after you've done that, basically you're going to kill all of them and pick up the FIB badge. Once you pick it up, it should stick to your outfit like this. So once it does stick, basically you're going to make your way to any ammunition on the map. So there's one like super close, so make your way over there to the ammunition. So once you're done, go inside, go to the outfit section and save this as an outfit. At least one time. Alright guys, so once you did save this, you're going to need to purchase pair a parachute. So go to the front counter, go to parachutes, go to parachute bags, and purchase the Israel troop bag. So after you purchase the Israel troop bag, back out from the counter, equip that the Israel troop bag on. So after you equip it on to the interaction menu, go to the outfit section and save this as an outfit. So after you done save this as an outfit, basically you're going to back out from the mask store and apply the outfit with the blue duffel bag. So whatever blue duffel bag you have on any outfit, equip that outfit onto the interaction menu. So I have a blue duffel bag on this outfit. So apply it. Once you apply it, make your way to the mask store with the flying vehicle. So fly really high with any flying vehicle. I prefer an oppressor. It is safer and better. So fly really high. Once you're high up in the air, jump off your oppressor and you will need to open up your parachute, then open up interaction menu, go to style and click the save outfit we made at the ammunition store. So apply that outfit, click it once, back off in the interaction menu and glide into the mask store. Okay guys, this part's very tricky, but I'm used to doing the double bag glitch. So basically you want your character to brag down into the mask store. So once your character is about to fall into the mask door, that's when you spam right on the d-pad now. Like once I fall into the mask door like this, spam right on the d-pad so the mask door should open for you. Once it opens for you, save this as an elf at least one time or two times. So once you done save it, back out from the mask door, walk away at least 10 or 15 feet and apply the new outfit we just made and your blue duffel bag should appear like this and bam. Also guys, the cool thing about this outfit is you could open up your interaction menu go to style and go to illuminated clothing and it has different options like flash 
illuminated um, on uh, this outfit does light up and it's really cool because it has a FIB badge and a blue duffel bag but yeah guys let's move on to the next outfit all right guys you will need pink joggers for this outfit if you do not have pink joggers I'm gonna leave a link in the description on how to get pink joggers and it still works so guys make your way to any clothing store on the map once you're at the clothing store go to the top section go to sports jackets and you will need to purchase the pink bigness puffer it is called the pink bigness puffer so after you purchase the pink bigness puffer this one you will need to stay at the top section so go to sweaters and find the all black turtleneck they do have a black t-shirt but i prefer the all black turtleneck it looks way better with this jacket so after you purchase the black turtleneck make your way over to the shoe section so once you're at the shoe section guys you will need to find the section called sneakers so once you're at sneakers you will need to purchase pink high top sneakers these and once you've done that make your way over to the accessory side and you will need to purchase some gloves the gloves you do want to purchase they are black tactical gloves now make your way to the mask store so once you're at the mask store find the section called characters and you will need to purchase the princess robot bubblegum and save this as an outfit one time so once you purchase this mask save this as an outfit and still stay at the mask store you're basically going to need to purchase a riot helmet so guys the riot helmet you do want to purchase it is called the black riot so after you purchase the black riot basically back out from the mask store and apply the safe outfit we just made and make your way over to a telescope so we could do the telescope okay guys so there's a telescope right here the telescope glitch is always working i remember there's some one guy that said it did not work it does still work it's very strict to get so run past the telescope push right on the d-pad your mask should disappear like this once you got the glitch to work open up your interaction menu go to style go to accessories and put on the black riot helmet and back out from the interaction menu walk away from the telescope and it should look all glitched out like this once it does make your way back to the master and save this as an outfit at least one time so guys your outfit should completely look like this it looks really amazing right uh yeah i really tried uh, so hard to make an outfit that looks like so cool with matching colors but also guys um if you haven't joined my discord i recommend it because it's getting filled really fast like it's so amazing everyone's friendly everyone's helping each other and also i do play with subscribers in the discord so if you do want to play with me i join the discord i recommend it because on saturday today's friday so tomorrow i will be doing a little car meet car races and playing with subscribers so if you do want to play with me i recommend joining the discord because i'll be playing with y'all and also we're going to be having like races we're going to be like it's going to be so much fun so much excitement but and also guys if you do want to donate i'm gonna leave a link down below to any donations to help and go towards the pc so i can live stream the events but yeah guys hopefully i did enjoy i also got some more clothing glitches comment below if y'all did enjoy these outfits if not i would start switching it up and also guys i found out like oh i don't want to say it but i just want to post the video i just don't want to like give out what i'm gonna be posting so i do have a video i'm working on it's like another save ceo alpha glitch but it's not the ceo version it's like i could save like different like rare outfits and i think it's really really easy i've been working on it and it's like really easy and also i got a tons of more glitches that i do have like stored in the treasure chest that i will post later on i do have other social media pages too uh, i have twitter and instagram i'm very active on both also if y'all guys want to follow those and if y'all guys have any questions about a glitch you can either comment down below in the video or if you need help without like if you missed a step on the glitch you could just dm me through instagram or twitter i'll be answering those completely okay guys i need your feedback so comment below if y'all do want more clothing outfit videos or y'all just want more money glitches or y'all just want like rp glitches 
and just comment below so i could get some feedback so i could start posting more like that but yeah guys hopefully i did enjoy give this video a thumbs up subscribe if you're new because i post every single day but yeah guys hopefully i did enjoy catch you on the next gta 5 online video peace